to see a little girl go from being in such pain that she's beating her head against the wall to being in remission in school years later, that's pretty, that's pretty huge. And then um, a few months later, a family came to me with a six-year-old little girl that had a brain tumor. And that's when everything changed. Um, that was when we decided to go from just infused oils to also making extracts. Because of the high dosage that she was gonna require, we needed to concentrate it down into a way that she could take it with much less volume. word got out that we were making extracts to help cancer kids and cancer patients and they started coming to us. They speak in waiting rooms, they talk online and you know and uh, it just uh, blossomed from there. There was a little girl that came to us um, and the doctors had said there's no point in doing chemo, there's nothing, it's, it's her, her, where, the, where the tumor is, we can't reach it, um, it's just keeping her comfortable until she dies. The mother reached out to me and at the time we weren't taking on any more people because it was just my husband and me and we didn't have, I mean we just didn't have the capacity. Um, and she begged me, she was like, please, I beg you. My daughter's you know, beating her head against the wall in pain, trying to make it, the pain go away, and she was two years old. So we made an exception and we provided her the oil. Um, she went into the doctor for a checkup and the doctor said, there's something going on here. Uh, I think it's worth taking a look. And they started chemo and doing the treatment with her. And that was, 2000, beginning, I think that was February of 2014, maybe a little earlier. Child's great, she's fine, she's in remission, she's in school, she's having a full life. Um, and to see a little girl go from being in such pain that she's beating her head against the wall to being in remission in school years later, that's pretty, that's pretty huge.